sweetheart, um, we need to talk. Okay. We found this pamphlet in your room. I, I can explain. Xavier's School for Gifted Youngsters? <laughs> sweetheart, why didn't you tell us you were a mutant? I don't know. <laughs> I thought maybe you wouldn't love me anymore. Wouldn't <sighs> love you anymore? Sweetheart, we couldn't be more proud. Really? So I can go to Xavier's school? Um, well, unfortunately, it's very expensive and private. So we've looked into some other options for mutant schools. Really? There's more than one school for mutants? Indeed there is. What? <laughs> I am Professor Zlankman. These are two of my students, and we are here to invite you to enroll in Zlankman's Community College for Semi-Gifted Youngsters. <laughs> Mutant Community College? Really, Mom? Just give them a chance. You don't even know what they can do. Allow me to demonstrate my powers, young lady. <laughs> That's it? Your power is sneezing? Yes. And every time I do, a random person in the world dies. What? Oh my goodness, that's horrible! Perhaps, but it's very effective when fighting my enemies. Effective? There's like a se one in seven billion chances it'll even affect your enemies. Not in the spring. When my hay fever acts up, I sneeze 12, 13 times. Divide seven billion by 13 and whoo! Then bad guys start to sweat. <laughs> I'm not going to this school. Okay, hold on. Uh, I'm sure this gentleman has a pretty cool mutation. Yeah. You better believe it, bub. Actually, you do look really familiar. Are you that angry guy whose bones are filled with adamantium? No, that's my cousin. My bones are filled with helium. What? That's why I have cement-filled boots. Otherwise, I'd float away like an angry balloon. So. Well, do you at least have claws? Better. Feather claws. <laughs> They usually always come out of my body, so. Are you crazy? Do you want some innocent Chinese or Indian person to die? That's not racist, it's just mathematically probable. Yeah. Ooh, your school is full of crazy people, okay? The only thing you have in common with Professor X is that you're both bald. Uh, I am not bald. <laughs> Okay, receding slightly, maybe. But these luscious locks are here to stay. Well, I bet you can't even... Honey, are you okay? Are you okay? You okay? It's okay? the hair. It has that effect on women. Are you singing up on our teenage daughter? I get it. I bet you can't even read minds. You're right, because I have a much greater power. I can interpret people's minds by carefully observing their body language. <laughs> and I can tell that you, young lady, are extremely happy about the prospect of attending my school. Hey, this guy isn't even a real mutant. Uh, yes, I am. Prove it. <laughs> See? Hey, 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 only 49% of the population can do this, so technically, that makes me a mutant! <gasps> it's a miracle. That's messed up, bub. You lied to us, Professor Z, and you will pay for that deception. Okay, how about we just look into some online mutant courses? Yeah, I heard Jean Grey is running University of Phoenix now. <laughs> See? Asian. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe to our channel. And like this video, too. If we get 30,000 likes, we're gonna make a new movie. Z-Men. Second class. It's about the Haitian missile crisis. It's not as big as the Cuban one, but it was still important and dangerous. Nick Cage is in it. So, 